Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTechGuru. In this video, I'm going to talk about the game turbo of features after the MIUI 13 update in my Mi 11X device. Right now, I'm trying to use a Mi 11X device. And finally, I did install the MIUI 13 update as in clearly see friends, which is a stable version, not the beta one. And after this update, let's see what are the changes did happen to the game turbo. That's what I'm going to demonstrate in this video. And is the security application which is available. And let's go to the game turbo here. And there's nothing much has been changed regarding the animation. Yes, there is no change in the animation. And you can see the, all the games and everything together here. That's kind of another thing. So next is about the options in the settings also did not change much overall. So you get this kind of new type of option and interface and everything is seems to be kind of pretty same. Nothing much huge difference. And let's go to the settings option and is a general settings and performance mode settings. You do have performance mode if you want you can actually enhance them. And apart from that, game do not disturb mode as well all of this and memory exception you can actually have that kind of option and let's start the game right now and here's a quick look at the game turbo of the new type as you can see when this is a miui 13 update game turbo which you can actually see here how the interface looks like here so first thing is that uh, we do get some additional advantages with the new miui r13 and the game turbo so which is called the performance mode so there's a balanced mode and there's a performance mode Every time you try to tap on this balanced mode, you get this haptic feedback. And if you try to change the performance mode also, haptic feedback. That's something you should know. And let me just start playing the game. And still the battery runs mobile game 90 FPS not updated after the MIUI 13. So in case if you are thinking of and clearing memory, you can actually clear the background RAM and catch and everything. And do not disturb mode. And we do have the screenshot mode, video recording mode. And let's try to record the video. And I'll try to show you exactly. And there's no option for uh, passing the video recording. Like some phones, they do have this kind of option, which is called, the, you can actually pass the video recording and you can actually continue if you want, uh, cont if you don't want to have this kind of multiple screen recordings. So that's something is missing in this Mi Linux device at this moment, exactly. And right now, let me show you another thing about the real-time FPS meter. You can see actually I'm getting about 1989 and 90 FPS because I've been using the config file in my Mi Linux device. That's the reason I was able to play. And next option is a Wi-Fi connection. We do have the Wi-Fi connection if you want to can enable and disable. And cast option is also there. And turn off the screen is also available. So the game will continue. So it can actually continue even when the screen is off. So you won't get kicked off after the game as well. That's something you should know. As you can see, the game is continuing still without any kind of problem. And next option is about the and uh, screen filters. So right now you can actually see the screen filters will be changing. Let me just slightly change the location so you should be able to see it. Yeah, saturated and bright and bright and saturated. Some little bit changes. I think right now it's not happening. Maybe there must be some kind of error. I think so. I think it's happening, but I cannot notice much. Let me check. I think little bit, little bit is happening, but not a huge, I would say. Just a little bit changes there in the colors. I'm not sure whether you will be able to see it in the camera, but it's not that uh, changing. Next is a brightness slider. We do have the option of brightness slider. In case if you want increase and decrease, you can actually increase. And settings option, which will take you to the game turbo settings menu here. And next we do have the voice changer. So which, which did have a lot of voice changes, as you can see here. So since this is a different kind of uh, MIUI 13 update, that's the reason we do have plenty of voice. So which is kind of paid versions of the voice changes you are having exactly. I think the Indian version of the MIUI 13 will not have this option. You will be just having these five options. That's it. And these are the different options. In, in terms of the voice changes, I think they won't bring them to the Indian market anyway. And apart from that, there's another option which is called the timer. So next is a timer option. You can actually select the four different timers as well. That's also another option is available. So nicely start and stop. That's also another uh, fantastic option which we are having at this moment exactly. Start and stop. So that's it friends. Thank you for watching. This is a quick uh, in-depth review on the game turbo in the MIUI 13 update regarding the latest game turbo features, which I thought of just explaining for you all. And overall, only the improvement which I did see, addition of the time, I think timer is also available before. But I did not see any kind of major improvement, I would say, with the game turbo, apart from this performance booster, 
which is available in case if you want to have a better performance. Apart from that, nothing much major changes I have noticed. And finally, I forgot to mention one of the options which is called the floating window. So where you can actually select the couple of applications, so which they will try to work in the floating window as well in this manner. As you can see, friends, you can actually play the game by giving this floating window as well. You clearly see, this is how it actually works. If you want, you can actually minimize as well. So I think let me need to uh, quickly check is there any option to minimize or not. So you can there's no option to minimize, but you can actually expand and you can actually make it a little bit of small. But apart, apart from this much more small, it cannot go very small. That's it. This is the lowest it can actually go here. So that's it friends. Thank you for watching. I think I did cover uh, all the topics necessary in the game turbo. Meanwhile, signing off. Until the state of more updates and bye.